it's Kaya with everybody in the background. This is Keeping Up with the Keepers, and we're gonna play with some ferrets. So L will take the video now, and let me get the ferrets. That's our founder, Shamay. Bye, it's the work. And she's leaving, but I need to go this way. That's Robert. Do you have any questions? If you guys have any questions, just please like and share our live videos. Today we're gonna be working with the ferrets. Next week, we're going to be training with the Tigers, so make sure you're liking and sharing our videos, getting entered into the raffle. We enter you into a raffle to win two free tickets to the sanctuary, so make sure you comment, like, and share our videos. So, these are a few of our ferrets that we're putting in for an enrichment uh, play area today. We have eight ferrets. <laughs> So these are only four of them. We have a little, another one back here, but she's a demon child and <laughs> she likes to bully everybody else. And then we have three more outside that only like to keep to themselves as well. So we only have the four today. So we have, hold on, let me go inside. Let's see, we have to keep an eye on this one, Miss, because she likes to escape. Okay, she can probably get through right there, probably. This is Zelda. Zelda's an escape artist. And she's a little stinker butt, but she's very sweet. And Zelda has a boyfriend. This is Zelda's beast right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is Zelda's boyfriend, Chunky Monkey French Fry. Look how big he is compared to her. Ooh. So they love each other. Again, they're giving each other kisses. Well, this is Zelda. And then this is French Fry. French Fry actually made international news because he was kept in a... In a um, box when he was given to the animal shelter with a bunch of french fries which is why he's a chunky monkey um and that's why he made international news because a ton of people were surprised and you can see he, they love burrowing burrowing in the hi cave. barry thank you for your sugars famous cookies oh, yeah. Yeah, they were good they were good, they were good. <laughs> we sell those now here then we have sinner Sinner's an old little ferret, and the ferrets only live six to ten years, so by the age of four, they're considered geriatric, or grandmas and grandpas. So he's our little grandpa. And then we have S'mores. S'mores is an escape artist as well, so we have to keep an eye on him, because he loves to get out of tiny places. And ferrets are extremely flexible. They have very flexible spines, which means they can get in. Woo! Yay! They love the little ball pit that they have. And you can see they have very sharp teeth because they can chew through the plastic too. They have little fangs, which hurts because they can bite you. They can bite through pretty much any of this stuff. Hi, Teresa. is because, um, correct me if I'm wrong, if there's anybody who knows more about the ferrets, but uh, we're an agricultural state. So the reason why you can't have ferrets is because if they were ever released onto the wild, they could outcompete native species and be very detrimental to our ecosystems, um, especially since we're an agricultural state. And you can't have them in Hawaii, California, Alaska, and New York. Those are the only places you can't have them. We miss you too, Serenity. <laughs> oh. <laughs> She's loving you. Oh, yeah. Hello, Stinker Boy. Hello. Oh, look at French Fry. <laughs> oh my oh. God. 
videos please thank you to all the nine people that are watching we to do this every whopping <laughs> nine people we do this every wednesday so make sure you guys stay tuned and look for our raffle you can also do um our instagram or check on our live facebook Besides Hi, the four, we have uh, three more outside. So like I said, we have Sinner, S'mores, Zelda, and French Fry over there. Um, but we also have Luna, and then we have uh, Kidney Bean, Cauliflower, oh wait, no. Kidney Bean, Loki, and Barbara outside. Do we take them to the schools? We do take them to the schools. They're our little educational, amb <laughs> our little educational ambassadors. So they love going out to see all the kids. What are you doing? Oop! Crazy man. I like to play. Hi, Francis. Hi, Cheryl. Cheryl is coming. Look at this chubby man. <laughs> Woo! And you guys can see they're super, super flexible. Ooh. So they can move in all different ways. <laughs> and their little tummies. And then they also have little canines. So you can scruff them when we need to clip their nails. And you can see they have sh super sharp canines on each side. And that's used to get their prey. Because they love eating meat. But here we just give them a uh, ferret kibble. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Make sure you like and share, like and share, be entered into a raffle to get two free tickets to Forever Well Sanctuary. Hi, Serenity. Yeah, noodle cats, she says, noodle cats. Oh my gosh. Bless you. Well, because they like to bury in their blankets, too, you know, so. <laughs> <laughs> French fry is the one that will tear into those little balls. Oh, 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 oh. Careful. She's not mad because he went inside. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's on the prowl. Hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> you cannot climb up there. He popped it. it. Oh. Hi, Teresa. Uh oh. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> right behind you, cut. This is a less interesting video, but. I don't know whether they're jumping around like that. Generally, we. We don't leave the camera on the animal, but I want to start doing that more. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you guys for watching our live videos here at Forever Wild. Try to check out our Facebook page, our Instagram page, our PayPal account if you feel like donating. There's a whole list of things that we would love to have. Hi, Shane. Hi, Cheryl. Oh. Thank you for educating us on these silly creatures, Kaya. You're welcome. You're welcome, Cheryl. Does anybody have questions about these marvelous oh, little creatures yeah, that love to escape? Any questions that you have? Also, if you have any ideas that you want us to go live for. Right now, we're just taking one animal at a time, and we're just explaining in detail their habitat, what they eat, how long we've had them, their age, how much we love them. Bloop. Oh, they're, they're related to weasels and polecats and minks. Yeah. Um, a lot of people get 
<laughs> the ferret's confused with minks, but minks are much larger than the ferrets. And minks have special oil on their uh, fur, so that way it doesn't get wet right away, which is why a lot of people have killed minks for, uh, or have had minks in fur farms because they like their special fur because it's super soft. And unlike the ferrets, they have that oil on their fur so that water doesn't seep through. Um, but minks are much larger than the ferrets are. And they're a lot more aggressive. Serenity is asking, how long is their lifespan? Six to 10 years. I don't have any other facts about the ferrets. <laughs> thieves. They are thieves. They're actually, that's another thing. Their name uh, in translation actually means little thief. And they are thieves. Yes. They'll steal your rings. Your keys. They'll steal your watches, your keys, <laughs> your wallets. They usually have a special treasure site, which is usually underneath a couch or a cupboard <laughs> or in your drawers. <laughs> Also, make sure that you watch us next week. We're going to be going live with one of our volunteers who is a trainer. Oh, all of a sudden, everybody. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think it's the hay. And yeah, Shannon's going to be training a few of our keepers with the tigers. So make sure you watch us next week. It's going to be really interesting. Oh, hi, are you stuck? Ooh, Hello. oh, goodness. <laughs> Trinity would love to see a video about Turbo. <clears throat> turbo. I mean, we could go out and see Turbo for a few minutes. Would you like we to see Turbo? We just have to turbo? put everybody away. We could do a, a live about Turbo, even banana. Do we have banana? Mm-hmm. And just get facts. Yeah, you guys want to see Turbo, our ring-tailed lemur? Comment yes if you want yes, to see Turbo. Yes, if you want us to go outside and give Turbo this banana. Do you want to put this little girl? We can start putting the birds in there. They, they all just go in that same one. Time for bed. Come on, babies. All right. Come on, Teresa, you've got it. We are going to put He's these birds nice away. Oh, well, maybe not. We're going to go outside <laughs> to our lemur habitat. Well, maybe not. Make sure you guys are liking and sharing and commenting. <laughs> That's precise. Nice. Everybody nice likes one. to get Robert. Rawr. All right. Cool. 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 If you share our live videos, we will enter you into a raffle to get two free tickets Perfect. to our sanctuary, and then we draw them Perfect. once every four videos. So once a month, we'll have a drawing. We just had it, and we had a few winners, and we mailed their tickets out already. French fry is a chubby little man. Normally ferrets are not supposed to have carbs, which is why he's super chubby because he was in that thing with French fries the whole time. Uh, so that's why um, French fry is like obese. He's huge compared to all the other ferrets. He's got a chubby tummy. He's like, I go bed now. Okay. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Teresa. Everyone's commenting yes, yes, yes. Everybody, yes, yes. Everybody wants to see Turbo. Okay, Kimberly, you got it. All right, you got it. Let's get the banana. Oh, um, there it is. No, hold on. Did you get a banana? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so I should have enough. We're not going to spend too much time on Turbo just because I don't think I have enough battery percentage, but we shall see. If we end up going blank, that's because my phone died. And donate to the sanctuary because we're building a new one. Like I said in the last video, this is their smaller one, but we're trying to build the new one. So that way they have more room to swim with the snapping turtles too. But they're all sleeping inside the blue thing probably. Teresa says French fry came from her hometown. real quick. Hi. <laughs> Hi. This is Turbo. And Turbo's favorite snack of all time is banana. Which if he wanted to, he would probably only want to eat bananas the rest of his entire life. Because that's the one thing he loves eating. 
And you can see he chews with his mouth open, but that's pretty much the only uh, chewing that anybody loves to hear besides other people eating. <laughs> They'll tolerate Turbo's little chews. We all love Turbo's chewing. He's very cute. Now, Turbo's a ringtail lemur, and he gets that name because he has those black rings on his tail. But despite his primate roots, uh, he doesn't have a prehensile tail like other pro, which means when they're competing for a female, uh, he'll grab his and then he'll wave it in the air and then the female gets to pick whoever's the stinky they'll fight and stuff but usually they do the hi guys i know this isn't a ferret if you look in the beginning of our video we had the ferrets earlier now we're at turbo I'll tell how many the people You're have spoken <laughs> i don't know how many species there are Sh cheryl says uh, that isn't there 40 or 50 Something her granddaughter 40. extreme fed turbo and she loves him 40 species there's around 40 species of lemur. I could be wrong, but uh, turbo species is only found in Madagascar, nowhere else. So they're only native to Madagascar. And right now Madagascar is fighting for their habitat. They only have 10% of their natural habitat available in Madagascar right now, unfortunately. And they have a specialized claw called a toilet claw and that's meant for grooming purposes. Toilet claw. And their teeth are specially made to be sort of like a comb because they groom each other so much. So his teeth is like a comb. Little kisses. Ooh, thank you. And he makes a little special call to all the keepers here as well because he thinks we're his troop. Um, so he makes like a little noise. Um, he probably won't do it now because his mouth is stuffed with banana. But he, he only talks to us that way because he knows we're his little family. Um, he'll also scream. If you've been to the sanctuary, he screams at the macaws <laughs> because he doesn't like how loud they are. <laughs> More nana. I'm just supposed oh. to lick the salt off my fingers. <laughs> Can I say first? Yum. And there you, you can see his specialized little toilet claw. His big old thumb. Hi, Todd. From Cherry Valley. You don't want no more nanner? Like and comment on our videos and share and you'll be entered into a raffle. Let us know what you think about Turbo. So that's why he has that big old patch of fur on his back. And Turby. L. Our wonderful keeper has made this special little hammock for him. Yay! He's a little nervous though. He doesn't really use it too often. Yee! And he's confused as to why there's a camera pointed at him. <laughs> he doesn't like being famous. Turby, look. More nanner? More nanner? No nanner? Wow. Wait a minute. Get my right side. <laughs> they also have allo parenting which basically just means babysitting. So if there's another female that the female trusts, she'll go ahead and hand her baby off to her while she goes to use the restroom or forages for food. And he, what he's doing right now, uh, he's trying to prove he's the man. So he's trying to show that he's the macho man around here. And he's, he, he'll probably pull his tail up too and start scent marking it. Turbo. Nana? Nana? Oops. He pooped. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, Philip. Yes, we'll be doing these every Wednesday, probably around the same time, like right now. Good job, Turbs. And eventually, we'd like to get every single animal in our sanctuary, one at a time. What did he eat? His apple? Uh huh. Oh, good job. Let's wrap it up. So that was pretty much the end of our little. You guys got to see Turbo. And Turbo's pretty fun to look at. Oh, he wants a nanny. So if you guys can, comment down below what you guys want to see. Because right now we're just kind of winging it. Because nobody's really kind of, oh no, said what they want to see. So we're just kind of winging it. Uh, we are planning on doing um, training with some of our tigers and our lion and bear next week. So if you guys tune in next week, we're going to do our training and you'll see how uh, we just clicker train some of our cats. 
Hi, Kimberly. Unfortunately, we don't have the neat bonita anymore, but thank you for that suggestion. If you hear screaming in the background, it's cheeky. She's over dramatic. <laughs> mm -hmm. So comment down below what you would like to see, and we shall see what we or other popsicles for our big cats animals. Uh, so this one was about the ferrets and the ring-tailed lemur. If you want to see anyone specific, just let us know. Otherwise, I'm just gonna pick somebody. All and right, Teresa. Go from there. If you have any other suggestions besides like what animals you want to see, like. If you want to see how we do barn or if you want to see how we clean.